Hey, what's going on with it? Once again, Bros Woman Bros of Texas is the one, the only, Nintendo Free 2011, aka Criticism Guy 2009. Speaking of which, before I begin real quick, today's brought by Powerade. Nothing new there. You guys already know the business with that. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, one more other thing real quick. Um, I'm going to be talking about this on my Criticism Guy 2009 channel, so all five of you that follow me there, definitely check this shit out as well, because I'm going to be doing a lot more of a deeper scale interview with this shit. Not interview, more like a review of this kind of scenario, so um, without further ado, let's begin this shit. <sighs> so, um, about yesterday night, 7 or 8 o'clock, a couple hours after I got out of work, and I went a little bit of bowling with my friends and shit like that, I actually found out about this really badass update that the PS4, they finally had some leakage and stuff like that, picture leaks off of the, what the future PS4 is going to be looking like, and we get this, and hopefully you guys can see it that well, because this is the best quality I can give it to you in check that shit the fuck out, you know, um, I'm gonna zoom it in for you so you guys can get a better view on this aspect of how badass this shit is, you know, <laughs> fucking amazing as hell, I do say so myself, you know, well, yeah, that's a really good close-up right there, so basically, let's get into this shit, um, so, um, I guess Sony didn't really have a comment to say about this stuff, you know, their hardware has always been very amazing, very badass, and real quick shout-out to Jake the Bomb for making a review on the rants how crappy the store is now, but back then it was a lot more better. I think it was about a year or two ago and they switched it up, so shout out to him. I'll leave a link on his channel down below so you can check his shit out. He's an awesome dude. He actually commented back on one of my videos, so big shout out to him. That's a peace out for him. Highly recommend you check his videos out. He's an awesome dude. He's a good commentator as well. So, uh, yeah, other than that, you know, um, my whole thoughts and aspects on it, I saw the fake commercial for it, and unfortunately it was fake. There was a couple, like, Reflections they had was Assassin's Creed and Kank, Knack. I never heard of Knack before, but I guess it's an okay game. And I think Jack and Baxter a couple times too. So I thought it was fake because um, they wouldn't be showing any of that stuff. Whoever had that high, you know, productive quality value, you know, that person must have busted their ass off for making that commercial. Because in my opinion, I don't think it was a real like commercial. It looked convincing to me, and then I found out it was a fake. Kind of pissed me off a little bit, you know, because I'm really looking forward to this shit. You know, obviously I have a PS3 myself, hello, at the fucking remote. Other than that, you know, um, last two things I want to say about this update is that, um, number one, it does kind of look like this Tron Legacy thing that they're trying to go for, which I have a Tron poster in the back, by the way, you guys can't see it, but maybe one day I'll show it to you when I get a brand new camera. I don't know when that day is coming, but until then, you gotta have to sit back, relax, and be patient with that. And then number two on my list is that, um, I have a feeling that, um, I know the remote's legit. I already did a video on that like almost five months ago and saying that thing was legit. You know, PS3 had their little PS4 conference or whatever with Sony. Little Asian dudes, because Asian people are smart as fuck, you know? They're badass. No offense to them, they're kick ass, you know? And, uh, you know, if they do make this real, hopefully they make a remake of Crash Bandicoot, Spider Dragon, Rayman, you know, etc. You know, the old school PS1 games that we grew up as kids from the 90s, you know? We, we never took it for granted. No, I never took it for granted. That was the best years of my fucking life. No, it's too bad I can't relive it again, you know? <laughs> yeah, and uh, one more thing I want to say. The power and safety buttons on this thing, it kind of looks like a little Wi-Fi connector. I don't know if you can see that. If I, like, zoom out for you and uh, show you another picture of it. It kind of looks like, um, I don't know what to say. It's like a power button mixed with a Wi-Fi connector, so I don't know if it's going to be like for... You know, cell phone, tablet, mobile carriers and all that, you know. I got a feeling it might be for like, um, you know, just in case you want to use your Bluetooth and shit like that for your communicators or microphones, you know, what have you. And uh, yeah, without further ado on that, you know, that's all I got to say on it. And like I always say before I close this video, like, comment, subscribe. And uh, peace out, bros and bros and pegasus sisters. I will see you when I see you. Have a good day. Have a good night wherever you're at around the world. Peace out. Take care, laters. And, um. Yeah, I'll see you guys soon, all right? Happy Tuesday, and uh, don't drink or smoke weed at the same time. Take it easy, YouTube, and uh, I'll see you soon, all right? Lates and goodbye. Peace.